The following is a list of artifacts objects created or modified by human culture that are significant to the historicity of the Bible. Topic. Selected artifacts significant to biblical chronology Topic. The table lists artifacts which are of particular significance to the study of biblical chronology. The table lists the following information about each artifact Name Current location, museum or site Discovered, date and location of discovery Date, proposed date of creation of artifact Writing, script used in inscription if any. Significance, reason for significance to biblical archaeology Refs, Anet and Cuz references, and link to Adidio Princeps EP, if known Topic. Other significant artifacts Topic. Topic. 2000 BCE Topic. Creation myths and flood myths, recorded on the Epic of Gilgamesh, the Atra Hasis tablets, the Enuma Elis, the Eridu Genesis and the Barton Cylinder Law tablets, ancient Near East legal tablets, Code of Hammurabi, Laws of Eshnunna, the Code of Ur-Namu, King of Ur ca. 2050 BCE, the Laws of Eshnunna ca. 1930 BCE, and the Codex of Lipit Ishtar of Aizen ca. 1870 BCE. Later codes than Hammurabi's include the Code of the Nesalim, Hittite Laws, the Assyrian Laws, and Mosaic Law, Ten Commandments, see Cuneiform Law. Hittite texts and Nuzi texts 17th century BCE and later. Minoan eruption, pumice found at various tells dated to Late Bronze Age Execration texts, earliest references to many biblical locations Shifra slave list, Shifra was one of two midwives who helped prevent the genocide of Hebrew children by the Egyptians, according to the book of Exodus chapter 1 verses 15-21. The name is found in a list of slaves in Egypt during the reign of Sobekotep III. This list is on Brooklyn 35.1446, a papyrus scroll kept in the Brooklyn Museum. 1500 BCE Tombs of Amos, son of Ebana and Amos pen Nikabet, record the earliest records of Egyptian control of Canaan. The Bible's depiction of Israel does not allow for Egyptian control over the area. Amarna letters c. 13th century BCE correspondence on clay tablets between the Egyptian administration and various Middle East kings petty sub-rulers in Canaan during the New Kingdom. The Bible's depiction of Canaan at this time the period of the judges contradicts these records. Great Hymn to the Aten is seen to possess strong similarities to Psalm chapter 104, which may be based on it. A Puer papyrus probably 18th century BCE poem describing Egypt as afflicted by natural disasters and in a state of chaos. The archaeological evidence does not support the story of the Exodus, and most histories of ancient Israel no longer consider it relevant to the story of Israel's emergence. Nevertheless, a Puer is often put forward in popular literature as confirmation of the biblical account, most notably because of its statement that, "...the river is blood." and its frequent references to servants running away. This ignores the many points on which Apuwer contradicts Exodus, such as the fact that its Asiatics are arriving in Egypt rather than leaving, and the likelihood that the river is blood phrase may refer to the red sediment coloring the Nile during disastrous floods, or may simply be a poetic image of turmoil. North wall of the Medinet Habu Temple and the Papyrus Harris c. 1150 BCE depicts the Ramesses III's conquests in Canaan including the Battle of Jahi. This is not reflected in the biblical history. Topic. 10th century BCE Topic. Early Paleo-Hebrew writing – Contenders for the earliest Hebrew inscriptions include the Gezer calendar, Biblical period Ostraca at Elah and Isbet Sarda, and the Zayat stone Pim weight, evidence of the use of an ancient source for the Book of Samuel due to the use of an archaic term. Kerbet Kiyafa Pottery Sherd 10th century BCE inscription, both the language it was written in and the translation are disputed. Was discovered in excavations near Israel's Elah Valley. 
Tel S. Safi Potsherd, 10th to mid 9th centuries BCE, Potsherd inscribed with the two names ALWT and WLT, etymologically related to the name Goliath, and demonstrate that the name fits with the context of late 10th, early 9th century BCE Philistine culture. Found at Tel S. Safi, the traditional identification of Gath. Kerbet Kiyafa shrines, cultic objects seen as evidence of a cult in Judah at time of King David and with features triglyphs and recessed doors which may resemble features in descriptions of the Temple of Solomon. Ophel inscription is a 3,000-year-old inscribed fragment of a ceramic jar found near Jerusalem's Temple Mount by archaeologist Eilat Mazar. It is the earliest alphabetical inscription found in Jerusalem written in what was probably Proto-Canaanite script. Some scholars believe it to be an inscription of the type of wine that was held in a jar. 9th century BCE Amman Citadel inscription 9th century BCE inscription in the Ammonite language, one of the few surviving written records of Ammon. Melkart Steel 9th-8th century BCE William F. Albright identifies Beer Hadid with Ben Hadid I, who was a contemporary of the biblical Asa and Basha. Ostraca House probably about 850 BCE, at least prior to 750 BCE 64 legible Ostraca found in the treasury of Ahab, written in early Hebrew. Balaam inscription c. 840-760 BCE 9th or 8th century BCE inscription about a prophet named Balaam cf. the Book of Numbers. 8th century BCE Topic. Kuntilat Adrid inscriptions 9th-8th century BCE inscriptions in Phoenician script including references to Yahweh Sapphire Steel 8th century BCE described as the best extra-biblical source for West Semitic traditions of covenantal blessings and curses. Steel of Zakir 8th century BCE mentions Hazal king of Aram. Tel al Rima Stella C. BCE tells of the exploits of Adad Narari III, mentioning Jewish king of Samaria. Shebna's lintel inscription, 8th 7th century BCE, found over the lintel or doorway of a tomb, has been ascribed to Hezekiah's controller Shebna. King Ahaz's seal, 732 to 716 BCE. Ahaz was a king of Judah, but did not do what was right in the sight of the Lord his God, as his ancestor David had done." 2 Kings 16 verse 2, 2 Chronicles 28 verse 1. He worshipped idols and followed pagan practices. He even made his son pass through fire, according to the abominable practices of the nations. 2 Kings 16 verse 3. Ahaz was the son and successor of Jotham. Bully c. 715 to 687 BCE or 716 to 687 BCE Clay Roundel's impressed with a personal seal identifying the owner of an object the author of a document etc are like astraca relatively common both in digs and on the antiquities market the identification of individuals named in bully with equivalent names from the bible is difficult but identifications have been made with king hezekiah and his servants avadim in hebrew Annals of Tiglath Piles are 3, 740 to 730 BCE. Layered 45b plus 3r9, 1 possibly refers to Kur Sa Mi Ri I Na A A as Land of Samaria. The Iran Stella refers to Kur Sa M E Ri I Na A A, Land of Samaria. Layered 50a plus 50b plus 67a refers to Uru Sa Mi Ri Na A A, City of Sarnaria. Layered 66 refers to Uru Sa Mi Ri Na, City of Samaria. 3R9.350, refers to Menahem the Sumerian. Nimrud Tablet 3R10.228-29, refers to the overthrown of Pekka by Hoshe. One fragment refers to Azriao, and another it has been joined to refers to Yaudi. Some scholars have interpreted this as Ahaziah, Uzziah, although this is disputed and has not gained scholarly consensus. 3R10.2 refers to Kur-e-hu-um-ria, land of Bit-humri. 
ND 4301 plus 4305 refers to Kur e Hu Um Ria, Land of Bit Humri. Babylonian Chronicle ABC 1, 725 BCE, Shalmaneser V refers to Uru Sa Ma, Ba Ra in City of Sarnaria. Annals of Sargon II, 720 BCE. Nimrud Prism, Great Summary Inscription refers to Uru Sa Mi Ri Na, City of Samarina. Palace door, small summary inscription, cylinder inscription, bull inscription refers to Kur Bit Hu Um Ria, Land of Bit Humri. Oldest papyrus mentioning Jerusalem in the Hebrew language. Topic: Seventh century BCE. Topic. Bulla of Gemariah son of Shaphan R. 609-598 BCE possible link to a figure during the reign of Jehoiakim Jeremiah chapter 36 verse 10. Archaeologist Yer Shoham notes, "...it should be borne in mind, however, that the names found on the bully were popular in ancient times and it is equally possible that there is no connection between the names found on the bully and the person mentioned in the Bible." Seal of Jehuchel 7th century BCE Jehuchel or Jusel is mentioned in chapters 37 and 38 of the book of Jeremiah where King Zedekiah sends Jehuchel son of Shelemiah and the priest Zephaniah son of Maseiah to the prophet Jeremiah saying back quote, please pray for us to the Lord our God back quote, Jeremiah chapter 37 verse 3 his seal and also one of Gedaliah, son of Pasher, also mentioned in Jeremiah chapter 38 verse 1 together with Jehuchel were found during excavation in the city of David in 2005 and 2008, respectively, by Dr. Eliot Mazar. Kerbet Beit Leh contains oldest known Hebrew writing of the word, Jerusalem, dated to 7th century BCE. I am YHWH thy Lord. I will accept the cities of Judah and I will redeem Jerusalem. Absolve us O merciful God. Absolve us O YHWH. Mesut Hashavyahu Ostrakhan is an inscribed pottery fragment dated to 7th century BCE and written in ancient Hebrew language. It contains earliest extra-biblical reference to the observance of Shabbat. Victory Steel of Esarhaddon 6th century BCE Kedah Hinnom Priestly Blessing, probably the oldest surviving texts currently known from the Hebrew Bible, Priestly Blessing dated to 600 BCE. Text from the Book of Numbers in the Old Testament. Described as, one of most significant discoveries ever made, for biblical studies. Jehoiakim's Rations Tablets 6th century BCE describe the ration set aside for a royal captive identified with Jehoiakim, king of Judah cf. 2 Kings chapter 24 verses 12, 15-6, 25-27-30, 2 Chronicles chapter 36 verses 9-10, Jeremiah chapter 22 verses 24-6, 29-2, 52-31-4, Ezekiel chapter 17 verse 12. Nebo Sarsecum tablet circa 595 BCE a clay cuneiform inscription referring to an official at the court of Nebuchadrezzar II, king of Babylon, possibly the same official named in the biblical Jeremiah. Lachish letters, letters written in carbon ink by Hoshea, a military officer stationed near Jerusalem, to Joash the commanding officer at Lachish during the last years of Jeremiah during Zedekiah's reign c. BCE see Nehemiah chapter 12 verse 32, Jeremiah chapter 42 verse 1, 43-2. Lachish fell soon after, two years before the fall of Jerusalem. House of Yahweh Ostrakhan is an ancient pottery fragment discovered at Tel Arad probably referring to the temple at Jerusalem. 5th century BCE Elephantine papyri, ancient Jewish papyri dating to the 5th century BCE, name three persons mentioned in Nehemiah, Darius II, Sanballat the Horonite and Johanan the high priest. 2nd century BCE Hasmonean coinage 164 BCE to 35 BCE 1st century BCE 
Topic: Western Wall, c. 19 BCE, is an important Jewish religious site located in the old city of Jerusalem. Just over half the wall, including its 17 courses located below street level, dates from the end of the Second Temple period, being constructed around 19 BCE by Herod the Great. The remaining layers were added from the 7th century onwards. Topic: 1st century CE. Topic: Rock of Calvary, Golgotha, identified by Constantine's mother Saint Helena and Macarius of Jerusalem, within the Church of the Holy Sepulchre. Grotto of the Nativity, identified by Constantine's mother Saint Helena and Macarius of Jerusalem, within the Church of the Nativity. Pilate Stone c. 36 CE carved inscription attributed to Pontius Pilate, a prefect of the Roman-controlled province of Judea from 26 to 36 CE. Pool of Bethesda – In the 19th century, archaeologists discovered the remains of a pool corresponding to a description in John's Gospel. Delphi inscription c. 52 CE The reference to proconsul Gallio in the inscription provides an important marker for developing a chronology of the life of Apostle Paul by relating it to the trial of Paul in Achaia mentioned in the Acts of the Apostles 1812-17. Erastus inscription Roman period, disputed Judea capta coinage after 70 CE Nazareth inscription bears an edict of Caesar prohibiting grave robbing. Topic. Controversial Topic. Borsippa, identified as the Tower of Babel in Talmudic and Arabic culture, but not accepted by modern scholarship. Ebla tablets, once thought to have made references to, and thus confirmed, the existence of Abraham, David and Sodom and Gomorrah among other biblical references. Foundation stone, stone also called the Well of Souls, now located in the Dome of the Rock. According to the Bible, King David purchased a threshing floor owned by Arauna the Jebusite, and some believe that it was upon this rock that he offered the sacrifice mentioned in the verse. David wanted to construct a temple in Jerusalem, but as his hands were bloodied, he was forbidden to do so himself. The task was left to his son Solomon, who completed the temple in c. 950 BCE. Uzziah tablet 8th century BCE or 30 to 70 CE controversial tablet discovered in 1931 by professor E L Sukhanik of the Hebrew University of Jerusalem in a Russian convent Jehoash inscription controversial black stone tablet in Phoenician regarding king Jehoash's repair work suspected to be a forgery but see book of kings Warren S shaft possible route corresponding to the biblical account of Joab king David S. Commander, launching a secretive attack against the Jebusites, who controlled Jerusalem. Ivory Pomegranate Tower of Siloam, ruins possibly mentioned in the Gospel of Luke. James Ossuary Talpiot Tomb, Joshua son of Joseph Tomb, its identification with Jesus is highly controversial. Caiaphas Ossuary Sidarium of Oviedo Titulus Crucis Acheropoieta, see Shroud of Turin, image of Edessa, and the Veil of Veronica. Relics attributed to Jesus, including those identified by Constantine's mother Helena and Macarius of Jerusalem, such as the Holy Nails, Holy Tunic, and the True Cross. Shapira scroll, widely discredited following its 1883 release, has been reassessed following the 1946 discovery of the Dead Sea Scrolls. Topic: Forgery. Topic. Stone Seal of Manasseh, Stone Seal of Manasseh, King of Judah c.687-642 BCE. Reportedly offered to a private collector for $1 million. Shapira Collection Topic. Significant museums Topic. Israel Museum, Jerusalem Bible Lands Museum, Jerusalem Hecht Museum Oriental Institute, Chicago British Museum The Louvre Topic. External lists Topic. Anet, Ancient Near Eastern Texts Relating to the Old Testament. Third edition with supplement. 
ed. James B. Pritchard. Princeton, Princeton Univ. Press, 1969. Cuz, The Context of Scripture. Three volumes. E.D.'s. William W. Hello and K. Lawson Younger. Leiden, Brill, 1997-2002. Rain, Readings from the Ancient Near East, Primary Sources for Old Testament Study. Baker Academic. ISBN 978-0801022920. Indices to Anet and Cuz, 1 and 2. Dr. Ralph W. Klein's Tables of Artifacts 10 pages of tables sorted by era Extra Biblical Sources for Hebrew and Jewish History 1913. http://www.egyptologyforum.org/.eftexts.html slash slash Bible History Daily The Biblical Archaeology Society website, Publishers of Biblical Archaeology Review Topic. See also Topic. Archaeology of Israel Assyrian Siege of Jerusalem Assyro-Babylonian Religion The Bible and History Biblical Archaeology Excavations and Artifacts Chronology of the Bible Cities of the Ancient Near East Hittite Sites, Hittites, History of the Hittites Library of Ashurbanipal List of Biblical figures identified in extra-Biblical sources List of burial places of biblical figures List of Egyptian papyri by date List of megalithic sites Model of Jerusalem in the late Second Temple period Near Eastern archaeology Nag Hammadi Library, early Christian Gnostic papyri Non-canonical books referenced in the Bible Oxyrhynchus papyri, collection of Old and New Testament papyri, apocryphal works and works of Philo Levantine archaeology List of proposed Assyrian references to Kingdom of Israel Samaria. References, <references>